Before anything else, I would like to apologize for misinforming last week when I thought episode 12 is the last episode for Higa Hero. My bad on that. Anyway, going into the episode, you know what? If we classify Sayu's mother as someone who is suffering from some kind of mental illness, it actually becomes much easier to rationalize everything she's done in this episode. Like, I have two options as I was watching this episode. Call her the worst mother in the world or diagnose her with mental difficulty. While the latter won't excuse her actions, it's a much-needed euphemism if we are to give her some form of escape from all of her actions. But let's face the reality. I'm pathetically trying to quote-unquote reduce her sentence if this were a courtroom, but we all know she just fucking sucks as a mother and she's only a mother in name really. All she ever did that could be considered as a motherly thing on her part is giving birth to Sayu. And everything else is just the work of an asshole. In hindsight, she easily wins worst mother of the year, though there really isn't much of a competition in there, so that's basically hers and hers alone. With that said, Yoshida did what Yoshida did best, and it appears he found a weak spot in Sayu's mother, to our surprise of course. In any case, next week's the real finale for Higehiro and everyone, including myself, is looking for that season 2 announcement. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I thank you all for watching and see you guys next week for the finale of Higehiro.